Video game quest. I need you to speak up. All right, but right now we're going to switch the game over to Dark Dreams Don't Die and see. Hopefully. Oops. Oh, I only have one choice for resolution, huh? Okay. There you are, video game quest. Perfect. Perfect. Got a message open. Now, these games will be given after my broadcast is over today, so don't expect them until then. But I have you all all, uh, all uh, Twitch messaged open, so I have all the, all the tabs ready to go. So, there we go. All right, let's hope this just works. I have no idea what this game in entails, except it's got it's Japanese-style animation. That's it. That's all I know. Okay, good. Perfect. Using only the mouse or only a controller. Sweet. This game is batshit insane. Okay. Afghanistan animation. <laughs> That's a fun word. Afghanistan animation. Automatic saving feature. Okay, good. New game. I like I like that you said it's batshit insane. That makes me happy. This is work of fiction. Any similar similarity to actual persons, places, organizations is purely coincidental. All right. <laughs> David. What? This is a story of a man with a very strange fate. Hey, look. Oh, don't Navi like me. I've grown wings. Don't oh, you are Navi. <laughs> no. I deleted the cheat folder because there was nothing in it. <laughs> I don't know what that was for. The day it all began. Johnny Car Wash! What's going on, man? Ah, fuck! What the fuck is this? Oh, playism. <laughs> Owl is my only weakness. Oh, why? It always itches. Developed by Access Games. Investigate the clues. It's frozen. Oh, read all the observation. Okay. Has a dull shine. Ah, all right. Grab it. Okay. 
<laughs> yep. That is one of my, that is honestly one of my favorite, one of my favorite fucking, uh, theme songs of all time. Hold on. Like, seriously, dude, how can you not love this? I just, every time I hear it, every time I think about it, I gotta play it. Every time I hear, like, even think of it, I gotta hear this song. Because it's so good. Around the world to Carolina. To Belize. On a slow boat to China. Tell me where in the world. Carmen San Diego. Sing in the blues. Carmen San Diego. Nashville to Norway. To Zimbabwe. Lubbockia <laughs> and back. <laughs> Told the beans from Lima, tell me where in the world is Garmin San Diego. Where? Rockapella. God, I love you, Rockapella. Thank you, Rockapella. You guys are awesome. I actually got a chance to see those guys in concert. I saw those guys in concert and they fucking killed it. They're, they're so good. Um. And also the uh, the uh, um, the Folgers like commercial theme. The best part of waking up. You know you can play the original Carmen San Diego MS DOS game online right now. I did not know that. I did not know that. Where can I get that t-shirt? Oh, the Iron Face t-shirt? It was a limited time running. It was a limited edition. Uh, it was Sour kool Show. I don't think you can get this shirt anymore, honestly. Anyway, sorry, let's keep moving. Whoa! Oh, damn, okay. Grab it. Grab it. Reef warning. Push. Oh, push. Pow, 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 pow. Daddy. He seems worried. Always nice. Love you. Hi. Wow, he seems like really loving. Move closer to the owl. Get out of that fucking snowball. Fuck you, snowball. Pow, 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 pow. Oops, damn it. Keep forgetting. Left does this and right does this. Pure white. Beautiful.
I grab it. Push the owl. Now that doesn't seem very nice at all. Pow! How do you like that, owl, bitch? <laughs> Fuck you, owl. So I pushed it, and now I'm gonna touch it. All right. Uh-oh, uh oh quick time event, here we go, quick time event. Just stand there. Good idea. Just stand there. God won't help you now, little girl. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah. I wonder if this is a if this was a Japanese song and it's just this is just the English translation. I'm completely unimpressed with this bubble I'm blowing. I'm falling into a bathtub now. With a miniature table and a phone. Okay. We got a drunk bubblegum chewer with a shoe fetish. Oh, oh. I gotta get up. Stay in character for best synchro rate score. Strawberry flavor. I didn't see you again this time either. Douchebag. Little Peggy. My scar aches, old wound, old scar. My name is David Young, former knock with the Boston PD. And now a detective who searches the past. My likes include 100% de agave tequila. My dislikes are mainly- Wait a minute, wait a minute, he's a cop from Boston? He's a, f he's a fucking cop from Boston? And then I see her dancing at the wedding with you know who. Shoes. Wait a minute. There we go. I'm saying he worked at the airport. It's clean. Under my own environment. There it is. It makes me sad. Oh. It's a regression. Wait a minute. I'm curious to see you in this neighborhood. He's clean. And if I could slander my own environment. It makes me sad. There we go. Uh, regression. I wish it was right on the fucking... I don't know if it's beyond some fucking cock prick like Queen and to pull you out of the stage... Here it and is. ...and you after me. <laughs> I just can't know. I don't know what they do in that particular department anyway. No! No! Are you still a cop? No! Are you still a cop? No! No! Swear on your mother's grave, you're still a cop, you're not a cop! Are you gonna stop doing coke deals with your jerk off 
fucking cousin. Man, it's not at all like you remember it. I remember it like being it like way more Bostony, but like Jack Nicholson does not pull off the Boston accent very well. Two years ago, someone killed my wife. Since then, I've been using every second of my life to solve the case. Using a certain, a very special power. Huge Twin Peaks David Lynch fan. So am I. Three fruit flavors. What the fuck is up with goddamn... <sighs> lollipops. Grab that. Oh. It's been broken since that day. Old crack, broken sink. Shit's broken, don't work. Ah. Uh. Okay. <laughs> A gift is an expression of emotion. The person who sends it wants the feelings to be understood. Sometimes, however, those feelings remain in a slightly different form. Dominic Bean. I Dominic? Forgotten treasures. Mementos. Now that Dominic is spelt like Dominic of the boy's name, not Dominique. Still so worn by uh, the librarian at the BPL. Perhaps it was a gift from the lover. It has the name on the back, Dominic Bean. Oh, maybe that's the designer of the shoe. That could be. Like Manolo Blonix or whatever. Manolo Colonix. Mild men of librarian by day. At night, she lured men with her wiles and sold them drugs. Maybe the sender of this shoe was one of her one of her victims. Either way, she wasn't D. The memento has lost its power. Okay. Just fucking close, thank you. Oh, now that's a raid, baby. That's a fucking raid. This pack attack. Who are the this pack? Who the fuck is responsible for this fucking goddamn shit right now? Who's responsible? This pack. Well, I'll tell you what. Birthday covers to the walls. Grab your hands. Grab your weapons. Oh, I've got this helm still with no horns upon it. But that's okay. Because I have that. And the fuck knuckle of this pack. Drive them back to where they came from. Mm. Games, you and me, Mono, E Mono. Are you ready? <laughs> got your nose, bitch. I got your motherfucking nose. <laughs> and then, oh, I ate that shit. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. Hell yeah, what is going on? This games. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate that, man. Very nice of you. Uh come on now. There we go. Come on in. I hope you guys are having fun today. I'm it's indie Sunday today. I'm playing all kinds of independent titles uh, that I have never played before. We are on right now. We're on to D D D4, Dark Dreams Don't Die, which I've never played. And it's got a very distinctly, I don't know, 
Japanese sensibility? I already did this. I already did this. Close. Okay, so that's it. Permanent blood stain. My wife died here. Oh, thanks. Thank you. Long time viewer, thanks for the fun, man. You betcha, brother. Thank you, Vis. <laughs> there are no standards. <laughs> Grab that. Little Peggy. <laughs> it's so funny. I just appeared out of nowhere in this bloodstained bathtub. <laughs> Everyone has their own place to work. Mm. A small desk in an office. I fucking missed the prompt. A quiet library. Damn it. The register in the supermarket. Or in the middle of an intersection, in bed, on a golf course, a kitchen. For Staring, the whole moles near her eyes. <laughs> oh, shit! She hit him the with day she died, a ten dollar pistol. has been my place to work. Okay, I wonder if I can do that again. But before we do that, we, we got, got a brand, brand new sub. sub. Hail this game's Barzy Herb. Fist this man, this game's rated strong and rated right. Welcome to Zeconia, baby. Shield, helm, hammer, and fist. Thank you, Vis. Appreciate that. I, can I do this again? I want to do it again. I missed something. Fuck. Oh my god. You know this? Oh my god. You know what this reminds me of? Like, okay. I'm going to do this. Like, there's a song, a YouTube video that accompanies this song. That that reminds me of, and I'm gonna see. Um, there it is. You guys have ever seen that fucking video, dude? All right. Nope. Okay. Take a dump of the toilet? I don't think so. Not yet, at least. Nope. Broken mirror. Reminder of that day. Okay, I got a check mark for that. All right, I guess I'll get out of here. <laughs> okay. No results this time either. This case is in the clear.
This case is in the is in the fucking clear. I don't know. Most people don't trust cops with a good with a perfect record. I do. I have a perfect record. Good. Get married. Test tells people your dick works. At least someone can put up with you put up with you son of uh, put up with your something. Uh, fuck. They always give Alec Baldwin such great speeches in movies. Put it back where he found it. Throw away leftovers. Keep the door closed. Scratches, tear store, Al. Oh, Tarson. Hmm. What a pain in the what? Was this made for motion controls? Oh, was it? Yeah, I, I, I played through Wolf Among Us because I'm a, I'm a big uh, comic book fan, and I played uh, I played it on um, or I, I read the entire comic uh, series of um, uh, Fables. Excuse me. And I have the entire, like, graphic novel series in my, on my shelf over there. So I, I played it, I loved it. I loved absolutely loved it. Sp ah, spicy soup. Gotta grab that. Can I have... Can I have some slurm? Oh, there, you gotta give me that ale. It's got a th thick taste. Okay. Oh, neat. Okay. Gold object can be used, white object can be pushed. What is this shit? Oh, I got it. I got to have a drink. I got to have a drink of this. How long are we in a D4? Yeah, I'm half an hour maybe. I'm just figuring shit. I'm figuring out how to, this game works. I need after work. Tequila. Tequila. Straight up. Nothing mixed in. Leave it to anime to make something that's just menial, very dramatic. <laughs> you always look so happy drinking that. I am. It takes away the monsters inside of me. I wish I could have a drink too. What? Cranberry juice is good for you. What? Are you on your period? That's from The Departed too. I'll take a cranberry juice. What? Are you on your period? Yeah, I hate tequila unless, and I'm not kidding you, I cannot stomach tequila or smell it unless it's Patron. Because it has a way less pungent tequila y odor. Did you hear about David's wife? Man, they were just married, too. I heard it was revenge for one of his investigations. All right, Scotty, have a good night, buddy. It sounds like the way they operate. Sending a deadly message. There are guys you can hit, and those you can't. Now he's not quite a guy. You can, you can, but he ain't one you can either. Fuck 
this case file. I have no memories of that day. The drug real blood, okay. When I came to, I was already lying in the ICU. The only thing I do remember are the words that little Peggy whispered as she died. Look for D. First person in chat is that D? makes a dick joke about the D. Words keep spinning in my head. I'm giving I'm putting you in the box. A joke is too easy. Don't do it. Don't do it. At the time, with no compelling evidence, the case hit a dead end. I quit the BPD. <laughs> Under the right circumstances, I now have the capability to solve even a dead end case. Dominic Bean is a lady, huh? I'll do everything in my power to find Shh. Closing the file. Putting it down. I want him to see him do. make toast. Oh, Peggy. <laughs> Amanda? I know, look. A letter from Peggy. Peggy's letter is a, uh, a one. David, the thought of you reading this makes me very happy. I hope you've calmed down a little? Question mark? <laughs> I hope. She doesn't know. She's not sure if she hopes this yet. I hope you've calmed down a little. I love you as you are, and I'll love the David you become. This is the second time I've written that. Do you remember the first time? Today I found all my old letters. It's strange they've become your case materials. All the letters I've ever I ever sent, a perfect collection going back to high school days. They're obviously important to you, so uh, stored so neatly. Maybe you respect them too much to tear them open. Is that it? So this is a challenge from the Peggy I am now to the David you'll become. I've hidden my letters old and new. I want you to I want I want you find all of me and all of our memories. And know the Peggy I was, the Peggy I am now, and the Peggy I'll become. Little Peggy Young, September 14th, 2009. Kitchen table. A place to think. English made. Everything went in here. She kept things tidy. Okay. Well, something, I mean, turn off the goddamn oven, man. Microwave. Splash of sticky sauce used every day. Thousand watts with a thaw mode. I got a burger in there, man. Well, I'm going to grab the fucking burger, man. Yeah. Mmm. 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 That fucking burger is fucking good, man. Mmm. Okay. Antique, non perishable goods. Had dishes here before. What do I put in there now? A cat. Jelly beans. Fuck yeah, I want jelly beans. I want some. I want some core. I'm sure, like corn checks, corn chunks. Corn chunks. I want some corn junk cereal.
Anything else I'm missing here? Okay. Cupboard. A pair tea set. She got it at the bazaar. Cups are dusty, nothing being used. Bandages. Protect wound. Medicine restores life. All right. What's going on? Oh, fuck me. Oh, whoops. Oh. Oh, pfft. I'm an asshole. Okay, that that was pretty fucking bad. Oh, I'm doing the wrong fucking stick here. I just failed completely on everything. I don't think I got a single thing right. Uh, also, because... Oh. You can't escape because this is fucking now. nutty. This is Amanda. She just suddenly started living here one day. She sometimes goes out and gets food for us. And that's something of a lifeline for me, as I don't really go outside. Just who she is, though, well, my memory holds no answers. She's got a nice case of heterochromia, though. That's pretty neat. Yo, David, everything ship shake? I don't know. We'll find out after a break. We're gonna take a short break, uh, ladies and gentlemen. It's top of the hour. This is the last break of the day. Oh, still on the raid music. This is the last break of the day. We're gonna take uh, this break here, and uh... is this? Oh, I don't have my shit. Oh God, it's been the same fucking song the whole time because I didn't have my song title thing going. Nice. Smart. All right, we're going to take a short break, three minutes. We'll be right back. We're going to play another hour of this, and then we'll call it a day. So uh, stick around. Don't go anywhere.
everybody. Welcome back. Thank you guys for hanging out with me today. During Indie Sunday, played a few games that were pretty cool. I gotta say, this this was a pretty decent Indie Sunday up, up until this one. I'm not saying like I don't like this one. I'm just saying this might not be my cup of tea per se. It's a little bit... I don't know. I don't know what the word you would use. Wacky? I guess it's a little bit wacky. Um, but tomorrow we will be going back to Far Cry 3. And uh, we'll be upgrading our... <laughs> we'll be having some fun <laughs> attaching rockets to things. So that ought to be fun. Um, but uh, before we do that... I don't know what you guys did during the break. But I did drugs! Cause I like drugs! I missed the business! In case you didn't know, I'm a unicorn in a suit! Yeah, that's right, bitches! As you can see, Teddy. Oh shit! Someone definitely got the jump. Oh, what did I pick? Did I pick Fatty? Forrest Casey. Shit! With the Boston Police Department and my former partner. He still helps me out nowadays in my search for Damn it. He's both a client and a source of information. Oh, did I say Far Cry? I meant Just Cause. Trouble. Whoops. It doesn't matter how old they get. Trouble. Fighting with Sorry. Again? <sighs> like you wouldn't believe. Women, men don't stand a chance. Uh, don't come and see me. Actually, means get right over here. But then, leave me alone just means, well, leave me alone. How am I meant to make sense of that? Tell me, David, please. Uh... Oh, there's a time limit. Oh, that's why. Okay. Uh, live with it. You know you love it. You got the stomach for it. Oh, that's not. Oh, stay in character. Okay. Yeah, quite enough. Thanks. Uh, I was a fool to ask you. Man, Diana is so stupid. Once feared as the mighty grizzly, detective among detectives. Now he's more like a big teddy bear. What's the point of the place? Teddy, what's this? So, tell me, David, have you heard the news about that airplane accident, huh? No, I haven't. Hey, Actually, Julia's here! Like 117, struck by unexplained lightning. Julia's here for Mr. Business. No one's talking about anything else right now. Why don't you do a drawing of Mr. Business, Julia? There you go. There's something you can do. Do a drawing of Mr. Business. Doesn't he give you enough, uh, enough inspiration to do a drawing of him? Boston. This fucking town. You ever looked at a fucking map of, of, of fucking Boston? Let me tell you. It was like laid out on a fucking map like spaghetti. Like they threw spaghetti at a fucking map. And they made a city with roads that like that fucking map. It's fucking retarded. Philip Cheney. And weather with Derek Buchanan. Little Peggy Young is going to be on the show today. <clears throat> you made one a few days ago? Get out of here. Are you going to show me a picture of like a turd or something? Mom spaghetti? Passenger simply vanishing from an aircraft mid-flight. Does that sound possible to you? Antonio Zapatero, otherwise known as Rabbit. He's a courier who only carries... Mom, rabbit. spaghetti, be Rabbit? This one promised to provide evidence after being brought to Boston. Evidence that may well have led to the ID of the source of real blood. But then the lightning struck, and in the confusion, he vanished. Vanished. Did he escape somehow? No. When I say vanished, that's pretty much what I mean. Like something out of a magic act. So, clue me in. What makes this one the real deal? Oh, I got an itch. Got an itch. 
Oh god damn it. The name of the boss he was going to give up? Boo boo kitty fuck. Apparently starts with the letter D. Oh this shit! Might have had evidence revealing the identity of D. So, interested uh, yet? Itchy. Let me ask you again. He's praying. Passenger simply vanishing from an aircraft mid-flight. Does that sound possible? Go ahead, get comfortable. Just take off that little vest there. Oh shit! Damn it! Oh, Almost come on! I was fucking around. That's why he brought this to me in the first place, isn't it? That sucks. Glad we're on the same. <laughs> nice fucking model. <laughs> Courier had the evidence with him. I tell you, there's got to be a third party involved somewhere. Whoosh. From the evidence I was able to bring, this particular item is the most interesting. Right, right, right. I know that badge was involved in this incident. Beetle, beetle drink. Beetle, beetle glass. Well, no doubt about it. This is a memento. Stupid! <laughs> he doesn't even have a horn! Julia looks like a dragon. Looks like Puff the Magic Dragon, Julia. Marshall's badge. Uh, bloody Marsh Bad. Piece of evidence relating to the case of the Vanishing Courier. It belonged to the Federal Marshal Derek Buchanan, who was killed, quote unquote, while transporting the courier in question. Using this should allow me to dive in, uh, to dive to an airplane, aboard which is D, the key to my wife's murder case. Should allow me to dive to an airplane. Hmm. New character outfit. Once a grizzly, now a teddy bear. He's my partner. Dirty shirt, pulled an all-nighter. Push him. Hey. Hey. Uh. Hey, buddy. Hey. 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 That's fun. David, taking care of yourself is part of your job. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, David? Feeling hungry? A bit. Okay, good. Let's eat. <laughs> I know you too. Well. I don't know. probably have only been drinking out. I think this guy is late for his aha video. Badge says detective for a reason, Teddy. Come on, 30 year old or 30 years or olders. Come on, aha video. Come on. Come on. Tell me, Teddy. What's up with you and Diana? Dirty Diana? Another how we roll. New York versus Boston again? That's the root of it. But both of you are originally from New York. Oh, fucking, I'm having... Oh, I'm having New England clam chowder. I'm having fucking chowder with oyster crackers. In Boston for 30 years, That's right, you gotta... If you're gonna have chowder, you gotta put fucking oyster crackers in it or it's not right. Nah, you still got her head stuck right up in New York. So what was it this time? Baseball? Basketball? Not football. Nope. But something bigger. But 
What's bigger than sports rivalry? Oh, uh, this one's bigger. Much bigger. It's all about clam chowder. Chowder, baby. Clam chowder. Mm hmm Yeah, clam chowder. No matter how you slice it, Boston has the best clam chowder in the world. You're, you're fucking ain't right. Right? right? Huh? Hell yeah, I'm fucking. You're Diana, right about I that. Can't see it. I have no basis for comparison. What? I've never eaten clam chowder anywhere but Boston. So it's the best in the world by default. Come on. Come on, come on! Oh, come on, David! Mm, sorry, uh, I can't help you out. I don't understand, I can't man. Say anything absolute that isn't based on personal experience. I need you on this. All I needed you to say was damn straight. Uh, Dude, really? Wow. Wow. Discovery of B. In April 2002, a Boston University study suddenly collapsed. Oh, a uh, Boston University student suddenly collapsed during a track and field practice on campus and was taken to the hospital. Even, even with the proper emergency medical response, the student died within the hour. The cause of death was acute heart failure. As he was a regular user of anabolic steroids, his death was considered to be caused by the drug abuse or as a side effect thereof. Although it seemed fairly cut and dry... I think it's, uh, I'm pretty sure it's cut and dried, but I don't know. I think it's like a, isn't it like a tanning term? Like you tan leather, you cut and dry it. It's cut and dried. I don't know. The deceased's possessions were seized as part of the investigation. A large volume of steroids were found, entirely backing up the original conclusions. However, among them, a new type of unregistered, unrecognized pharmaceutical was also reported. While the general steroid, steroids used for doping are enhancers with an anabolic reaction that increases the protein in cells. This new drug not only acted instantly, but also apparently allowed the strength of a user's muscles to be greatly increased with seemingly no physiological changes. Due to the... Wow, this is a big one. Due to the massive increase in comp competitive performance, it allowed, and it, uh, it allowed and its ability to pass all doping tests completely undetected. Word of the drug spread quietly but quickly among athletes, with black market trades conducted under the name B due to the red powder's resemblance to dried blood. In addition, the volume of the mar on the market was so small that exactly how to obtain it remained veiled in secrecy. Although clinical tests revealed no psychoactive properties, all who used it regularly prov uh, provided very similar testimony regarding its effects. The drug turned you into a god. And it's, it's not some filthy narcotic. It's the way to obtain your true self. Wow. Wow. Whoa, hey, what the whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, what the whoa, hey, hey, what the whoa, hey, hey, what the hey, whoa, what the hey, what the whoa. <coughs> so good. Now we're there you are. Amanda. Freeloading lodger. Smells like grass. Duck feathers in whiskers.
Oh my goodness. So I can dress I can dress my guy up. That's fun. I see. Okay. I have come here to chew bubble gum and, and kick, kick ass. ass. Send them all out of bubble gum. Are you going to play the Bloodborne DLC sometime? Love ya, Zeke. Oh, thank you, Keck. Yes, I will. I definitely will. I definitely will be doing the Bloodborne DLC, without a doubt. So I go to her, like, when I want to do... Like, I want to spend money on stuff, I suppose. Or spend whatever the fucking points I have. Making a phone call, save your progress. Sure. Picked it up. It's a dial tone. He goes, "Yep, dial tone. You're still there. That's good. I can count on that." Removing these is painful. <sighs> Let's spy on the neighbors. This right now. <laughs> Excuse me, what the fuck did you say? You don't have time for this right now? Fuck you. You have all the time that I say you have. Man, this is one one weirdo game. Ah, change the character's outfit, sure. Tortoise shell cat boot. There we go. No. Okay. How do I move? Hold on. How do I move through this? You know what? Fuck this. There we go. Wearing. New. Oh, I have to put it on her. Okay. I see. That's the one she's wearing once she's, once she's got on. Okay.
Got a match. Oh, my fucking lord. Oh, he's got to have that sloppy beard, I suppose. Give him the relaxed pants. Off-style off pants. He can have the 70s pants. <laughs> he's got detective pants. They're good for detecting... <laughs> They're <laughs> good for detecting things. And his detective shirt, which is also good for detecting things. And his detective shoes. Yeah. Holy God. Grabbing it. Thompsonville Penguins. Peeler Plank, bundle of evening editions. I'll throw it away someday. Really? I promise. Movie and comic magazine, cult film column. Yep. Read that shit. History of World Cinema Cannes Film Festival. This is the first time. Uh, it's that time of the year again, the Cannes Film Festival. Which entry will obtain the honor of Palm d'Or this year? We'll be covering the nominated entries separately, but here, let's take a look at the history of the festival. The Cannes Film Festival was established in 1939 partly as a competitive or a competition to the Venice Film Festival. However, the Second World War erupted on the day of the festival, and ultimately the first Cannes Film Festival was not held until after the end of the war in 1946. The Cannes Film Festival has faced stoppages numerous times since its beginnings. However, it has still managed to survive, continuing in some form until today. Thanks. I don't know why I would care about any of this. Grab it. Killer Instinct hoodie, huh? Anything else? Nope. He raises old trophies when he's alone. Yep. <laughs> That's a oh, bedroom door. That's where I just was. A lot of lurking, a lot of looking around. Yeah, Scanner Darkly is good call. Bookshelf built in. Investigation text. Detective Broad. Sports magazine. How to select a mouthpiece. Holy hell, man. Okay. You did it. Last week, candidate and team of associates. Don't care. I don't care. Sure, why not? Pick that shit up. Mickey Norman's Twilight Report 1. Spontaneous human combustion. A person can suddenly burst into flames. 
You believe in the existence of phenomenon? There was a bizarre occurrence in Boston last month. The University of New York and ashes. That isn't it at all. It's seeing serious differentian perm tandem fernand. I'm going to grab the TV. Oh, this game was published by Microsoft? Oh, it was published by Microsoft, but it still... It still was uh, created by... Uh, Access Games. Access Games is an independent developer. Doesn't that count? Doesn't that count? Oh, boop, 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 boop. Oh, this ought to be good. Have the cat around the baby. Cats have uh, what's that thing that they can pick up? What's that thing that babies can pick up from kitties? Forget there's a, there's like a disease or something. Oh, fade to black. Cat fever. Toxoplasmosis, thank you. That's what I was thinking of. Potato chips. Only sold in East Boston. Yum. Oh, fucking push that shit! Get the fuck out of here, you stupid squirrel. <laughs> I'm starting my dominance. Ah! 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 What the fuck are you doing? Get the fuck away from me, you son of a bitch! Get away from me, fatso! Back up, fatty! Don't care. Oh, I gotta push. Gotta push the plant. Record player. My only hobby. This is enough, right? It's enough. You, you're doing good. There we go. Blue cat, baby. Extra cases. Okay. Coffee and cookies. Give me that. Fortune cookies. Yeah, give me those. Fuck 
Fuck you, Cookie. Life is love. Oh, that's bullshit. That is god. That is utter bullshit. Twin Peaks. Twin Peaks it. Good coffee. And hot. Aw, oh, man, did you shit in my coffee? Did you shit in my coffee? Go to the main bathroom. Oh, and dive into the pass. Okay, let's go. Yep, yeah, fuck off. Let's get the fuck out of here. Go to the bathroom. Dive into the past. Oh my god, what are you doing? Eat that. No, cancel. Cancel that. Oh, this is shit you buy. Okay. All right. Okay. I know there's a push option. Pow, pow, pow. All right. No! Damn it! Nope. That's not... I want to go to... Nope. There you go. To the bathroom. And dive into the past, which is in the toilet. Teddy. <laughs> yeah! Sorry, I farted out here. I apologize. For I'm a fat time. shit, and I ate all your clam chowder. Problem. I fucking fought it out here. Partners, you may have quit the force, but that fact won't change. Well, if you trace it all the way back, if I hadn't asked you to join up in the first place, Teddy. That is a big door knob. <laughs> good call, you fool. None. That's a big door knob. That is a good call on that. I would have never fucking noticed how big that goddamn doorknob is without you saying something. Don't give me that look, Amanda. Just trying to give him a reason to live. Change my box. Change my litter box. Oh, I fucked it up. Little Peggy, time has been frozen for me since that day. <laughs> Will I see you this time? <laughs> Grab my eye. My eye itches. My actual pupil itches. I won! That's the game I won! I did it! I beat the game! I beat the game. That's awesome. Right on. Oh my god, new facial hair acquired. Mexican facial hair. Oh shit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we're being raided. And it's wild. It's a raid! The wild raid is here!
It's time to get wild and crazy. We're gonna be like fucking Nick Cannon up on this bitch and we're gonna wild out. Hounds on! Hammers out! Wild! I'm going to tame you! This is my taming stick! And then you're gonna get some from the little bitch. What's up, Wild? Thank you very much for the raid, my brother. Good to have you. Good to see you. Uh, we're playing a fucking weirdo, man. This is a fucking weirdo game, dude. I'm not. I'm gonna be honest with you. This game is a little, a little wackadoo. <clears throat> uh, it is Indie Sunday, so we are, um, we are playing independent games made uh, games made by independent developers. This one was made by Access Games. And it's a point-and-click clue Japanese This is a story of a man with Oh, hold a on very strange fate. Oh, we already did this part. Do we, do this? we don't do this again, do we? It's <clears throat> like I've grown wings <laughs> Oh, this is a different part, okay To a combat session, share the joy of fighting. You bet, man. I've had a little, a little bit of that. Episode one, Gordian knot. Okay. The lavatory. Oh, on an airplane. On an airplane. Why does everything start in an airplane? Or it start in a bathroom? Hold on a second. Hold on a goddamn second. Necrolim? Necrolim. We have to stop everything. Because you fucked up, Necrolim. You done fucked up. This is a cat. Do you see the cat ears? Do you see the cat eyes? Do you see the cat tail? Do you see? Time for a little instructional video. Are you watching? Are you learning? Maybe you won't ever make that mistake again. You got it? Good. <laughs> All mementos allows me to dive into the past. The day little Peggy was killed, I survived. Miraculously, somehow, I survived. In exchange for losing my memory, I gained this power. That has to be a sign of something. The past will surely tell me the truth. <gasps> oh! Well, got it. Yeah, Look nosebleed done. For D. Look for D. I can't get a voice out of my head. Who killed her? Just no. who is D? Yeah. The only way to silence that voice is to change my. The face. Fresh Maker. Dude, 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 do uh When it doesn't matter in life, that's better than life. When it's meant to face full of life, you gotta murder, murder case to solve now. You gotta murder, you can solve it with Mentos. Mentos, the fresh maker. Who is the killer? Could 
Conspirator? Mastermind? Witness? Or maybe... Fucking love Pez. I wash my fucking face. I look like shit. Oh yeah, brand new sub, baby. Hail, Garfang, Berserker, Garfang. Welcome to Zeconia, baby. Grab your shield. Join us, brother. Gorfang, what's up, man? Man or woman, I suppose. Thank you very much for the subscribe, or for the subscribe. You know what? I'm not even, I'm not even gonna apologize for that. Whatever. Seat. Plastic. Push it. Pow! God damn it. My sticky hands. Open it back up. Open it. Keep it open. There you go. Nice. Cool. All right. All right. Whoa, come on. What? Can I not, like, okay, fuck it, whatever. Grab it. Get out of here. Okay. From an airplane Too entertaining not to subscribe. Thank you, Gorfang. That's impossible. There's got to be something I'm missing. Wield a two-headed weapon. That's all right, man. Oh. Just strap the shield on your back like a turtle. It'll protect you. Are you okay? Protect your back. Give me that pee pee. David. Ah! Fuck! Sir, are you okay? No, I'm distinctly you not okay. I've seen a ghost. Damn it. Woohoo, she's easy on the eyes. I'm sorry. Hey, watch where you're going. Woohoo! She's easy on the eyes. Not a ghost. Just the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. Oh yeah, huh? huh? Please, oh, not today. Oh, come on. Let, let, let me grab your face. Let me touch your face. Oh, that's a nice nose. Come back to life. That is one nice nose you got there, lady. Mm. Oh, um, I have to get back to work. Let me grab it. Can I? I'm gonna grab your name Just tag. One thing, sir. What? You're surely aware that we carry a passenger list aboard. Oh! <laughs> Memorized it, have you? Shit got we don't real. Take kindly to stowaways, if that's what you are. A stowaway, am I? Hmm. Well, I don't know why stowaway is capitalized. Maybe you're on the. Livy Jones. Hey, punk. God damn it. Is it? Is it? My turn, asshole. Oh, oh, he got pissed. Or he's getting pissed? Oh, 
Oh, he's got a bullet wound by his mouth? You're a United States Marshal. Oh, let me... Damn it. a key witness. But reading a completely different file. Does that just mean... You're killing him. ...about your job? Or... Is there something else going on here? You. What are you doing here? Derek Buchanan. United States Marshal. The owner of the memento I used to get here. Along with a name that starts with D. Two signs I can't ignore. Yeah. I said D. -D. I'd you if I saw you again. Didn't I, boy? It seems we've already met somewhere. Shut it, Baldy! Only those with hair get to speak. I have hair. I just shave it off. I told you. You're a liar. Shaving it means you don't have it. Stay out of this. Antonio Rabbit Zapatero, the healer of the drug called Real Blood. Apparently, he also has evidence that could lead to the identity of Dee. If that's true, it makes him the most important person on this flight. You really have a death wish, don't you? Yet you might be the one who dies. Who the fuck has a pen like that anymore? Who the fuck has a pen like that? You should get out as quickly as you can. I'll keep the fountain pen. At least, may, at least I'm, you know, call attention to it. A fucking fountain pen. Oh, oh, it's a memento. A fountain pen belonging to Federal Marshal Derek Buchanan. Likely government issue, although it's quite a nice piece of stationery. The pen nib is bent, meaning you can't write anymore. Looks like it wasn't exactly handled with care. Okay. Bald, old gun chair wound, a fighter. He knows me, very hostile. Bears a grudge? I'm gonna, I'm taking your peanuts, pal. Fuck your peanuts. I'm eating these. Suck my dick. You haven't been on Twitch since then? How different do I like? Oh, with my long hair, you mean? Again, I I can't. I can't get by. Nothing suspicious. <clears throat> These look like souvenirs from the trip. Take it. your toy little kid someone put peanuts up there that's good I'm gonna I'm just gonna eat them I'm gonna chow down on those real quick can I oh can I do the emergency exit please let me do the emergency exit hey Water, water lets you see. Zip. Snow on the front, cherry blossoms on the back. They change them according to the season. Mm. It isn't totally atrocious, but hardly of a god now, is it? I'd expect no less flying coach, of course. Or would it have killed them to use a little real stitching? Honestly. And who might you? I don't ask for opinions from the uninspired. Suki, baby, what do you think? Dress all the seats white, then crown them with a single pink stag beetle? Oh, yes! Or maybe change all these to black lights, but not too dramatic. Just Does your mannequin ever reply? 
She's not a mannequin. She's my partner. She is? Yes, she is. I'm Duncan. And this is Suki. We're top fashion designers, the both of us. <laughs> <laughs> This guy's also a D. <laughs> this guy's also a D. Some people just don't get it. No matter how many times you tell them. My bad. I'm sure. Can I ask you something? I don't need your opinion. After all, I have Suki. The sunglasses in particular are strikingly progressive, don't you think? This is oh. The epitome of my next theme. <laughs> 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 